Hey, what's up, guys? I am Nadia Nakai, and you guys are watching Joburg Today. Welcome to another edition of Joburg Today. I am your host, Leroy Viaggi. These days, you can pretty much make jewelry out of anything. But who knew that anything included eggshells? As Marisa de Klerk finds out. What can you think this? What is this event? Ostrich my daddy. Oh, this is nice. I never thought it'd make jewelry. It's metal, metal with, which is hard, hard metal, stainless steel, together with a shell. So it's like um, brittleness together with, with diamond hardness. Um, and and that, that, that's, it takes a long time to do, and it's, it's kind of lots of pieces of, of two back to back. And that, that's where the fitting comes together. If you cut two circles and then you put them together, they're never going to match because it's from a, a, an egg shape. But if you twist that, suddenly it fits in like, and it's like magic. You can do any design, any product from an egg shell. It is more valuable than I ever thought it would be. Yeah, eggshell is, is a perfect raw material for making a uh, jewelry. It looks like it's, a, um, it's like a stone, but you don't feel a stone or a, a shell from the, you know, from the, so from the sea. No, it's not that, but it's an ostrich egg and it's so lovely. I was so unsure that it wasn't going to just shatter in front of us. But after a long time of me insisting and everybody fighting with me, we dropped the dental clay and it's, it's, it's very strong actually. We don't need to be insecure about it. That, that, that ostrich shell is actually thick enough and strong enough. I mean, if the Bushmen stored water for thousands of years, then, then surely we can make jewelry out of it. We're in business to make people look beautiful. Whether you do something in the natural shell, to a painted, to an etched piece. It, it, it gives great variety and individuality because the eggshell is also so varied in textures and so on. 12 years ago, Mambo Design sent their first pieces to a show in Frankfurt, Germany. And the rest is history. The business even weathered the bird flu epidemic, affecting the local ostrich industry. We mostly get the shells from Otsurin. The farmer um, barters with us. So he's got a show farm, he's got a shop. We provide him with the jewellery and he provides us with the eggs. It works very well because obviously he wants to keep it us supplied and, and, and that's been a great lifesaver because the eggs have at times really been a problem to source due to the bird flu and that kind of thing. When I cut it wrong, every, it affects everybody on the team. So I must be very specific when I'm cutting pieces so that the other, my other teammates won't have a problem in assembling and putting on the artwork. So it's very important to, to, to follow exactly the lines that I'll be drawing on top of the action and to choose the proper action according to the quality and the size of the design. We are the guys responsible for doing the, giving the, the, the ostrich action a picture that you see. I was shaking the beginning because I knew basic art, but then through working here at Mambo Design, I've learned so much. I perfected what I was, uh, I've been doing over the years, and then it became simple. It is easier, but it takes time. Tourists and the European market apparently especially appreciate the jewellery. But it's not all. I was really pleased to, surprised, wonderfully surprised to find in one of the trend websites, New York trend websites, that one of our necklaces, which did win an award at the show that I did in Paris, um, was, was featured there alongside Vivian Westwood and uh, Dolce & Gabbana and all those names. The one I love most is the one I'm wearing now. It's one of the geometric ranges that we came up with. It came from Dominic and I love this piece. That's, that's one that I really appreciate. Um, it's, it's done with the inside of the egg um, and it's got a very contemporary feel to it. It's also a reversible piece. So on the other side you see the natural eggshell. I never thought it would be so difficult to choose amongst ostrich eggshells. Marisa de Klerk, Joburg Today. How does this look, by the way? 